Now, as you might know from the last episode, Mike really, really loves the full bucket line. He loves just going on the line and saying, hey, wow, look at this. Whippee. I'm going to the full bucket line. I'm going to the full bucket line. I'm going to the full bucket line. I'm going to the UPR. Mike was very excited. He was almost at the yard. And he was going to take his first train all right, pretty much as soon as he got there. It was going to be awesome. If only his brother was there. He got destroyed in a roundhouse fire. He then realized he was going over the hill and that he had to stop. So he had to slow down. He slowed down as fast as he could. He was going at least 80 CPA, kph. Oh no! Help me, help me, I can't really stop. Mike, Mike was trying to defeat the hill and break. He wasn't doing too good. Mike was going in the fifth, was in the forties when he was being close to the yard. By now the speed limit was 30 miles an hour and he was going 40. But that's not what happened. When the speed limit hits 20 right about there after the curve, here's what happens. Help me! All the engines screamed, Mike? I want to hold this for you. Mike? And they, and then, the worst happened. The best happened, actually. Mike slowed down and was just about to go on the turntable. He said, Phew! Luckily, that's over. So slowly, Mike came up to the turntable, anxious to take his train. So eventually, Mike stopped on the turntable and started to turn. He slowed down right in front of it at the roundhouse. Mike creeped up to it. He blew his whistle. <laughs> Mike was going really slow onto that turntable. He thought he couldn't fit. Well, sure enough, he couldn't. So they were going to have to do something about it. Luckily, he did fit. 